for study on October 7th, how to improve listening skills. When we learn foreign languages, and then we start with the vocabulary, and then uh, we try to read the, the alphabets, and then we are listen to others, and or we read it. And next, uh, we try to read uh, loudly. It seems like uh, reading with the eyes, reading with the mouth, and then make a sound. And it looks like uh, speaking, basically. So, and then um, we are involved in the language communications, but, and then the listening is uh, one of the most important uh, skills in the language communication. Actually, language is help and then it's uh, very, uh, not wide. Uh, we're doing some comprehension and expression is all. Uh, comprehension is to see we can uh, comprehend and then what we see is uh, what we know and then in terms of languages and then we see the alphabet word sentence paragraph or some one page of script or the books newspaper there are many information about uh, some basic uh, information about it, all the things about, and then that is it. And also, um, comprehension is from the sound. We have ears. Actually, we have a taste and something we understand about uh, some uh, senses, six senses that we understand about and uh, comprehension. But normally, in uh, in terms of languages, we have uh, eye and ears. And then with the ears, so we have recognized sound like wave sound, bird sound, or dogs barking sound, and then people's calling sound. We recognize the voice, and and we understand about uh, we when we communicate with it, even though we don't understand about their how what to say, but we recognize the voice. So why it's very important part of what we. I listen to others because of the voice and then similar with the, the sound and then so each by each, word by word. And then and we are uh, can communicate with the uh, languages and then all languages by listening to others. So listening skill is very important. Then and that is the comprehension. Expression is uh, uh, the simple. We can express uh, like the body language, or we can express with the sound. We can speak. Uh, we can write. We can draw something, and then uh, we make some creatures. Uh, even we, I, I make this uh, voice diary. It also express what I try to do in uh, learning any languages. So, and then this is one of way to express myself. And then uh, while express is uh, become an artist and a specialist, normal people write a diary. And then this is a voice diary with a topic. So, and then it's an easy way to express myself in English. Actually, the purpose to learn uh, Vietnamese uh, by translating. And also the, um, we are uh, the, Expression is a translation, interpretation, also the skills of uh, languages, to, and then what we are doing, something. AI, how can we improve uh, listening skills? AI, how can we improve uh, listening skill in terms of uh, when we learn foreign languages? AI, how can we improve listening skill in terms of when we learn foreign languages? Um, then and I do the online language exchanges with the language partners. And then while, while we are communicate with it, I listen. That is one of the way to listen because uh, lots of opportunities to do that. When a beginner and intermediate the listening, doing online language exchanges is very good. 
And also I try to listen to the videos on YouTube and then I try to dictate while I listening, I try to write. Nowadays, I just uh, um, read the subtitle and writing at the same time. And when I listen to um, the, the talker in, on the video, and then, and, but, and then uh, next time, maybe without uh, um, subtitle, I try, I can try to write, dictate, write down to what I listen. This is a, a good way. Intensively, I can practice uh, listening skill and then this way. Uh, this is a very important part. And nowadays uh, I meet, um, normally I contact with the Vietnamese people who are who are trying to learn Korean, who are trying to learn English and doing online language exchanges. Sometimes uh, I do free talking. Then free talking is a very important one. And then while we are studying about it, and then and some it's very 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 important thing is pre talking. Pre talking is uh, uh speak and speak and listen and speak and listen. That is uh, the process of uh, the listening and the step of listening. Is the first uh, doing online language exchange with the language partners first. Second, the, while listening, dictating is the uh, third. Two or second. And then free talking and then communicate with the only sound, uh, with send the message with the voice and then uh, getting message with the voice. And I try to understand about that and then uh, that is it. Uh, today's topic is about listening skills. Um, the third year of uh, university students in Vietnam and then uh, she wants to improve, her, uh, she should improve her listening skills. Uh, so, and then she should improve listening skills. So, and then I, I try to just to make a copy. Talk too much. One, two. Three. Maybe three.
improve in the same skill when learning a foreign language. When learning a new language, we usually begin with vocabulary and then move on to reading the alphabet. After that, we start listening to other or reading out loud. And then, which can feel like we are reading with our eyes and speaking with our mouth, but not fully communicating. It doesn't quite feel like speaking naturally at first. As we get more involved in language communication, we quickly realize that listening is one of the most important skills. Language in itself is about comprehension and expression. It's true that we can comprehend written languages by seeing, but when it comes to communicating, listening is essential. Language is conveyed through sound and our ears and play a key role in understanding. When we listen, we recognize uh, different sounds, whether it's sound of a bird, a dog barking, or people talking, even if we don't understand every word. We can recognize the voice and tones, which is why listening is such a vital part of the communication. In language learning, listening helps uh, us get familiar with the sound of the words and the sentence allowing us to engage with the language even before we fully understand it. Comprehension also comes from the sound, and our ears help us process the language as we hear it. Over time, we recognize the different tones and patterns even in our language. We are not yet fluent in listening help us bridge the that gap between knowing words and understanding full conversations. As for expression, and there are various ways to communicate through body language, sound, speaking, writing, drawing, or creating something new. Keeping a voice style like I do, and then is one of one way of expressing myself in a language I am learning. This diary is not just a way to practice English, but also a way to document my thought and progress in fact. Expression is a skill in itself, and whether through uh, translation, interpretation, or just communicating ideas clearly. How can we improve listening skills when learning a foreign language? Practice with the language partners. One of the best ways to improve listening skills is by having conversation um, with a native speaker or language partners. I do online language exchange with the partners, which give me opportunity to listen to natural conversation. This exposure has improved my listening comprehension. And watch videos with the subtitle. I often watch YouTube video in the target languages and use subtitle. This helps me connect to what I hear with what is written. Over time, I try to rely less on subtitle as my listening improves. Dictation practice. Another technique I use is education. While listening to audio, I let down what I hear. It forces me to, to pay close attention to pron pro pronunciation and sentence structure. Voice messages. Um, exchanging voice messages is also a great way to uh, practice listening to by hearing someone will speak and trying to understand. The message I engage in real life, the language comprehension, consistent listening. And the key to improving listening is a consistency. The more you listen, whether to podcast, to conversation, or video, the better your ears become at, at recognizing pattern and meaning in the language. In conclusion, improving listening skills require active practice exposed to the language in different forms. And the constant apple is all about training your ear to recognize the sound and the pattern of the foreign language, and gradually you will understand more and more. Okay, then get them, 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 Ah,
و نویل و مین مین نون تو تکسو کم دای نو دان جاو تر موک سونیم ای چون تا دان جا و قوازن جاو تر نونی چون تا نیان چون نیان 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 لا لا دان نیه لا مو چون نون کی نان قوان چون نیت نون نو چو یو لا سو شو با جی دک Dung la chung ta po te ku nung nu Ve chung kwa vek nu Nyung ki jau te Nye dung bai cho kong te su Ong nu dok chuen da kwa am tan Ba tai kwa chung ta Doi bai cho jat chong chong vek nu Ki lang nye chung ta nyan la tak am tan kak nyau Yu la chen chim Tien Chiu Su, Hai Tien Nui Nui Chuen, Nai Ta Ki, Chung Ta Kong Chiu Thet, Loi Nui Chung Ta Ban Po Thè Ngan La, Yung Diu Ba Am Than, Do La Li Zhu Tai Sao, Nye Chat Ban Chong, Jo Chau Thet Ki Hok Nong Nui, Nye Chiu Chung Ta Lam Quan Boi, Am Tan Kua Chiu Ba Kao, Jo Pep Chung Ta Thiep, Sok poi nung nu ngai ka ki kua huan tuan huan tuan kiu no su siu viet kung den tu am tan ba tai kua chung ta jiuk su li nung nu ma chung ta nye te toi jia chung ta zan nyan là các âm dư và mau cao khắc nhau nhờ ta xuống một lòng nữ mà chúng ta sử dụng tao nhờ giúp chúng ta kết nối hôn các dư về chữ và chữ quan bộ cao xuyên Các cái chuyện gì nặng nhẹ luôn tháp bồi rồi tháp nông nụ Mỗi chung những các thuật nhà để cái chuyện gì nặng nhẹ là nội chuyên bồi nuôi và nữ Hoặc tôi tháp nông nụ Tôi tham gia các bồi trao đổi nông nữ chấp chuyên Chúc tôi có cơ hội nhẹ các cúc cho chuyên Chú nhẹ Chú này chú cái chuyện đáng kể khả năng chú nông nữ quả nhẹ Xem video có phụ đề, tôi xuống xem các video trên YouTube và ngôn ngữ tàn hốt và xu dương phụ đề dưới này giúp tôi kết nối những gì nhẹ tốt với những gì tốt viết dân dân. Tôi sẽ phụ thức vào phụ đề hôn kỳ kỳ năng nhẹ cải thiện luôn thấp cho chúng ta một kỹ thuật khác là luôn chấp À, chín tả khi nhẹ âm thần, à, tôi về lại những gì nhẹ đúc, như này vụt thôi phải chú ý đến phát thăm và cầu xuất khảo. Chào đôi chín nhàn trôi, việc chào đôi chín nhàn trôi cũng là một khắc thuyết bội để luôn nhẹ, thì nhẹ ai đồ nổi và cố gắng, chú thịnh nhắn của hồ, tôi tham gia vào quá trình thư nông nụ trong thức thể. Nhé chung nhẹn chí ác quá để cải thiện kỹ năng nhẹ là sức khuyên chí bên trang nhé như cho chú là podcast cục cho chuyên hai video tài quả bên càng quên bồi tắc màu cầu và âm tàn chung nông nụ độ. Tôn lại, cải thiện kỹ năng nhẹ đối hối sự lũ hình thạp tích quốc thiệp sức bồi nông nữ rồi chứ hình thức và nỗ lực liên thức à, qua tối giản à, đôi tay của văn sẽ quen gian bồi am tàn và các màu cầu sông ngồi nâng và dân dân văn sẽ hữu đốc nhiều hồn sông